American Express is known for having some of the best and most popular credit cards on the market, but they're not trying to exceed in banking by offering a checking account with a debit card that earns Amex rewards. So let's take a look at everything this checking account and debit card have to offer to help you guys determine whether or not you should get it. The American Express rewards checking account was introduced to the public back in February 2022 offering competitive interest rates and a debit card that earns Amex membership reward points on eligible purchases. One of the major benefits of this account is that it doesn't have many of the standard fees that other checking accounts have. For example, it has no monthly account fees, minimum balance requirements, or minimum deposit requirements to open or keep your account open. There are also no overdraft fees since it's a debit card, so transactions will be automatically declined if you don't have enough money in your account to cover them, which is great. No account fees are a huge selling point because a lot of banks usually charge dumb fees to keep or maintain your account open. Like Wells Fargo, for instance, who charges a $10 monthly fee if you don't have or receive a minimum of $500 per month in your checking account. So the fact that Amex is offering a checking account without the standard fees is amazing. Now, although Amex won't charge a minimum balance fee, you'll need to fund your account within 60 days to keep it open. Inactive or unfunded accounts may get closed. Other fees like a 2.7% foreign transaction fee also apply when using the Amex debit card. So if you travel often, using a different card with no foreign transaction fees will be a better option. You'll also be able to withdraw money completely for free at over 37,000 money pass ATM making it very easy to access your money on the go. However, you may be charged fees when using ATMs outside of the MoneyPass network, so make sure you're within the MoneyPass network ATMs in order to avoid fees. And you'll be able to deposit money into your account using online transfers from one bank to the other, direct deposits, and mobile check deposits. On top of no account fees, this account is FDIC insured and currently offers 0.6% APY, which is higher than the average checking account interest rate. Now, this is a good rate, but other banking platforms like SoFi now give 1.20% APY on their checking account or 2.5% with direct deposit. So there are some other checking accounts that offer much higher APYs than this one. But 0.6% is still really good compared to the national average. And with the Amex Rewards debit card, it could be worth it for a lot of people. Now the Amex debit card will earn you one membership rewards point for every $2 of eligible debit card purchases. This is in my opinion where this account shines the most if you're interested in earning Amex MR points. You can currently only redeem your MR points for a cash deposit into your checking account at 0.8 cents per point. For example, 10,000 points would be $80, 20,000 points would be $160, and so on. But if you have an Amex credit card that earns membership rewards points, you can link your accounts and access all the redemption options offered by that account as well, which means you'll be able to maximize your points and use them for other redemption options like gift cards, travel, combining and transferring points to partners, and much more. So the fact that you can earn MR points makes this debit card a great option for those times where you can't use a credit card because you'll be able to earn rewards on your purchases, which is not very common for debit cards. On top of rewards, this debit card comes with protection benefits like zero liability fraud protection, which means you won't be held responsible for fraudulent charges made on your debit card, plus purchase protection, which helps protect purchases made on your card. So anything you buy that's accidentally damaged or stolen within the first 90 days will be covered up to $1,000 per occurrence and up to $50,000 per account per year. The card is also contactless so you can tap and pay at participating merchants. Plus, you'll be able to add your debit card to digital wallets like the Apple Wallet app and others if you like. You'll also have access to the American Express mobile app where you'll be able to reach 24-7 customer service, deposit checks, set up bill payments, send or receive money via Venmo or PayPal, manage alerts, access your MR points, and much more. Now, there are some cons to the American Express checking account. For starters, the account doesn't currently offer a sign-up bonus to people who sign up for this checking account, which may be a turnoff considering the amount of checking accounts on the market that do. However, I don't doubt that in the future, Amex will offer a bonus to attract new customers. They actually mention in their terms that from time to time, some accounts will be eligible to receive a welcome bonus of either a cash deposit or MR points that may be converted into a cash deposit, so we'll have to wait Wait and see. On top of no bonus, this checking account is only available to Amex credit card holders who have had a credit card for three months or longer. In other words, if you don't have an Amex credit card account for more than three months, you cannot apply for this checking account. I'm not sure why they made this product exclusively for Amex credit card holders, but I feel like it should be available to everyone. But again, we'll have to wait and see if they change this and if they end up adding a welcome bonus in the future. Lastly, you won't be able to deposit cash into your Amex checking account because your only deposit options are 
are mobile check deposits, direct deposits, or transferring money from one account to the other. Meaning if you get paid in cash or you want to deposit cash into your Amex checking account, you'll need to deposit it into another bank account and transfer it into your Amex account since there isn't a cash deposit option. So if this might be a problem for you, then you should definitely consider looking at other online checking accounts that accept cash deposits or a more traditional bank with physical locations. Overall, I believe that the Amex checking account lacks a lot of important features that people look for, like a higher APY, sign up bonus, early paycheck features, cash deposit options, and much more. In my opinion, the most valuable features this account offers are its rewards earning debit card and no account fees. But there are other online checking accounts that offer the same and even better features and rewards. The SoFi checking and savings accounts, for instance, offers up to a $300 sign up bonus, no account fees, two day early paycheck feature, a rewards earning debit card, 2.5% APY, cash deposit options, and much more. When you compare the Amex checking account to the SoFi checking account, you instantly realize how much money and benefits you're leaving on the table. However, if your goal is to earn as many membership reward points as possible, the Amex checking account and debit card may be worth it because you can use the Amex debit card to pay utility bills, rent payments, or any other transaction where debit cards are a cheaper option than credit cards and rack up some MR points along the way. But if you have Amex credit cards that already earn MR points, you can earn points much easier and faster than with the Amex debit card. So what I'm trying to say is that the only time you'll really benefit from this debit card and account is when you can pay with your regular Amex credit card because interest wise, it's just not there. So we'd love to hear how you guys feel about the Amex checking account and debit card. So please comment down below and let me know. And if you made it this far into the video, comment the word Amex so I know who my real besties are. Also, if you're interested in great credit card offers with huge sign up bonuses, or if you wanna earn some extra cash back plus $30 with Rakuten, make sure to check out my links down in the description. It'll help my channel out like crazy. Having said that, thank you guys so much for your love and support. We're officially 9K strong, and I have to say that you guys inspire me to become a better version of myself each and every day by simply believing in me and watching my videos weekly. Lastly, please be careful with the scammy wannabes in the comment section. I don't have any backup accounts, and I'll never ask you guys for any information or money, so stay safe, peeps. I love you guys. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. That way, I never miss out on any future uploads. And if you like today's video, make sure to watch this other one next where I review the SoFi checking account, aka my favorite checking account of the moment. Okay, bye now.